Hey, it's Brian G. Johnson. I'd like to welcome you to this video, and I'm really excited that you're here. You see, just having you here lets me know that you're really excited about internet marketing, that you're exploring avenues in which you can make more money online. And this picture is 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 proof in the pudding that it's very, very possible. You see, since 2003, I've been full-time online, and what I want to do is I want to share with you what's working right now in internet marketing. And I want to give you this information so you can start taking pictures like this and living the life that you're after. You see, this picture was just taken days ago in Sedona, Arizona. I took my wife to an amazing resort. We had a tremendous time together. We ate at the best restaurants. We sp spent uh, time at the best hotel. And it was really made possible because of the success that I've achieved in internet marketing. And it really all starts with understanding how to drive more traffic. And that's exactly what we're going to talk about in this very video. You see, nothing matters more than your ability to drive traffic and to focus on that very thing and to get results. So with this video, I'm going to share with you what I'm doing right now to drive more traffic to my affiliate sites. It's exciting stuff, and I'm pretty confident you're going to like it. One of the things that people ask me all the time, you know, gosh, Brian, you know, what is the thing that's most guaranteed? You know, should I do AdSense? Should I do affiliate marketing? Should I build a list? Brian, should I do YouTube marketing or should I do Facebook? What's the very best way to get started? What's guaranteed? And what I'm going to share with you is perhaps, I don't know if it's the best way to, uh, to get started. That really depends on you. But what I am going to share with you is a method that I've been using to drive traffic that pretty much for me at this point since 2007 has been unstoppable. And what I mean by that is it's not guaranteed, but uh, I, I do an action, and about 80% of the time I get results, I get page one listings, I drive traffic, and again, since 2007 I've been doing this, that's more than five years of proven results. And best off, this is uh, free, it's pretty darn easy, and it's duplicatable, okay? You know, one of the things that is disappointing is is that people are always looking for the next magic bullet for the next thing that's just uh nearly unbelievable and yet so many people are willing to you know believe in stuff that couldn't possibly work you know google is the 900 pound gorilla in the room and if you've given up on google i understand the fact of the matter is that seo it's getting harder and coming from a guy that has focused his energy on seo that's almost like crazy that i'd say that but the fact of the matter is it is harder and with the recent google panda and google penguin updates you start to ask yourself you know how can i possibly make this work for myself. I'm on a small budget. I can't spend, you know, oodles and oodles of uh, money on advertising. How can I drive traffic? How can I gain authority? And that's something I want you to think about. Really important. And not only that, but trust. How can I gain authority and trust to overcome Google Penguin and the Panda? And this is exactly how you can do it. Over the last several weeks, I've been kind of thinking about SERPs on fire. What the heck does that mean? Well, first off, this is what you should be doing. This stuff absolutely works like gangbusters. And what it means, for those of you that don't know, SERPs stands for Search Engine Results Pages. So when you go and search Google, the page that you get, the listings of different uh, websites and videos and, and whatnot that you receive from Google, that's a SERPs page. Again, Search Engine Results Pages. And since 2007, the SERPs have changed dramatically, and it, they continue to change, and that's exactly what we're going to talk about. I want to share with you some ideas in this video on how you can get your website listings to stand out, how you can easily leverage some of the big channels online like YouTube and Amazon and Facebook, how you can leverage simple plugins that don't cost a dime, how you can do different things to ultimately rank better, 
to have listings that stand out and ultimately to drive more traffic. And that's why we're calling it SERPs on Fire because really things have changed dramatically. That's what we're going to talk about. So pre-2007, if you were to go to Google and search for something yummy like baking strawberry rhubarb muffins, this is kind of what you would get. You'd get uh, some results um, that pretty much just highlight text web pages, you know, cooks.com, uh, strawberry rhubarb muffins. Uh, here we have, I uh, can't see the address in this small image, but another plain text web page. That's all you really got prior to May 2007. Again, here we have uh, the kitchen.com, strawberry rhubarb muffins, and that's all you saw. If you wanted to get a, a recipe, right, right there, a recipe, you'd have to click the link dig deep deeper and get recipe results from Google. Now maybe you wanted to get a video so you could watch someone and get some tips on creating and baking some yummy strawberry rhubarb muffins. That all changed in uh, May. Again May of 2007 and Google decided that really what people wanted was to get all these types of listings uh, like blog listings and image search listings and news listings and shopping result listings. They wanted to see books, maps, and a, a lot of other results. And instead of having to click these links on the left of the search, uh, Google started to show these results right in the, the, the main page of Google. And that was the introduction of universal search. Now, at this time, I had been doing video marketing for maybe three months or six months. I can't remember exactly when I started because I started back in 2007, a long time ago. But obviously, with for me, having I think probably maybe 75 videos that I had uploaded to YouTube, I was pretty ecstatic to know that some of my videos might make it to page one of Google. And indeed, that is exactly what happened. Now, as you can see here, I've got a video listing for the, the term eBay Affiliate Promotion. Go ahead and search for that and see if you get it too. There's a, a video that I recorded back in 2007. And immediately when Google switched over to Universal Search, I started enjoying these kinds of results. And this is, folks, listen up. This is really important. You know, if you can't beat the penguin, if you can't figure out how to rank a website, don't smack your head against the wall. Do the thing that's getting the results. And we're going to talk more about how darn easy it is to create videos. You know, this video that I'm recording right now is being recorded on an iPad. It's being recorded on a, an app called Doodlecast. It's so easy to create videos today. Now, maybe you don't have an iPad. Maybe you want to create video with your iPhone or with your Droid or with one of the many, many free websites online that allow you to create quality videos quickly and easily. Notice that my face isn't in the video. I'm uh, not shooting myself. I haven't shaved. I haven't taken a shower. And that's okay because I'm just doing a simple presentation. And that's the power that we live in today in 2012. So don't say I don't want to. Say, well, how can I do that in a, a manner that fits with what I want to do? So right away, I was pretty darn happy with the way things are going. And w the other thing I want to draw your attention is this is what's happening with the search engine results pages in 2012. We're going to talk more about this kind of listings where Darren here, you can see Darren's picture, he's got a small image next to his uh, website results. And it's really powerful when you can do that kind of thing. And I'm going to share with you some ideas on how easily it is for you to do that coming up as we continue with SERPs on Fire. Now, before I go ahead and I, I kind of continue and share different methods with you, I want to let you know that I teach this very stuff that I do. If you want success, if you if you want to travel like I do, if you want to stay in the best hotels, maybe you're just looking for another $500. But you need to know that this stuff absolutely works. It gets great results. Here is a video I just published on April 18th again, of this year, if you search for News Alert Plugin, I'm, I think, number one. Or maybe it's, uh, let's just say it's page one 
of Google. And when you do this over and over again, it has a profound effect on your ability to, to get people's attention and to get what you're after, which is that money. In fact, to date, my YouTube channel has been uh, a view, the videos, I should say, the videos on my YouTube channel have been viewed more than 200,000 times. And my friends, when you do that kind of thing, when you upload videos, when you uh, make use of these methods, you get tremendous results. I practice, the, I, I practice what I preach, you know. And lastly, no links, no special software, no fancy scripts, no hiring people on Fiverr. You just make videos and you upload them. You pay attention to keywords, you put them in the title, that's it, you're done. That, my friends, is called smart marketing. You know, earlier I mentioned that it's never been easier to create video than it is today. And I really mean that. It uh, doesn't matter uh, the financial uh, means that you have or you don't. Maybe you're loaded. Maybe you don't have a lot to spend. You can use free tools online. You can use stuff you already have. A lot of you right now have the capability to create videos. However, some of you might not even know it. Like I said, you don't have to spend any money. Free, Animoto can create great little free videos. We've done this. I've done this on some of my sites. Gotten great results. GoAnimate.com, another uh, example of a great website you can use. Doesn't cost you a thing to create simple little videos that get results. Go ahead and do a Google search for free slideshow creator. Now, if you've got an iPad or an iPhone or maybe you've got a, a Droid, you can grab some uh, apps to make videos like iMovie and Videolicious and HD Slideshow. Now, uh, the video you're watching right now, it was recorded and is being recorded right now on an app called DoodleCast. Can you believe that? An app that cost me less than five bucks, probably cost me two ninety nine or ninety nine cents. It does a great job. It's never been easier. Stop making excuses for why you can't or you don't want to. Get into video because it's going to help you get the kind of results that you're after. Speaking of result results, let's talk a little bit about that. Now here you can see, I've got a channel on YouTube that's got thirteen hundred. 57 subscribers and what's really uh, impressive and what really makes me wonder and think you know what kind of results could so many people be getting if they've been doing video for a few years I've had more than 200,000 video views now a video view does not count until someone has watched the entire video and when someone watches a video you have a chance to engage them to interact with them to uh, really give them a full presentation, to, to give them what they're after. And so many people have said to me, Brian, I bought that thing because of the stuff I found on, on YouTube that you put out. This is exactly what you can do as well. So YouTube's great, but what's better, what's better than YouTube? Well, what if you could get video listings on the Google result pages, right? SERPs on fire. What if you could get those same kind of listings? Here you can see this is a video listing. This is an icon, it's an image of the video and those kind of listings get so much more traffic. They stand out on the page, right? And what's more powerful than YouTube is when you can get that kind of a listing and you can send people back to your own site. And you can see here this arrow that's pointing in, that's pointing to one of my domains. And what's interesting is the, the site actually got in trouble with Google. I had a, a virus uh, maliciously attack my site and the rankings dropped except for the video listings. Again, I mentioned earlier that video is probably what I would consider the most unstoppable traffic source you can be leveraging. And it's really great to do just that. So I want to highlight again this kind of SERPs on fire. Again, the idea is that it's quick, you know. You're going to do it. You're going to spend some time. You're going to get listings on Google quickly. It shouldn't be too technically difficult. It should be easy. It should be free. Ideally, you don't have to spend a bunch of money to get up and running to drive traffic. And remember, that's what this video is about, how to drive more traffic. And... 
This one's big. Your, your listings on Google stand out tremendously because oftentimes you get an image next to the listing. And most, you know, a text-based web uh, listing does not have that image. So let's talk a little bit about some additional uh, sources for SERPs on fire and how you can really take advantage of this uh, opportunity to drive more traffic and to have listings that are enhanced. Google Plus came along not too long ago and it's kind of grown slowly but there are many things that you can do with a Google Plus account that can have a tremendous impact on your business, okay? Again, remember, traffic is key. Anything you can do to improve your traffic is a good thing. Google authorship is just one of the things made available to Google Plus users. You create a Google Plus account and you simply state in your account that you're uh, an administrator or a contributor to the various websites you own and boom, you get an image listed in your results. And as they say, an image is worth a thousand words. This is the kind of stuff that you could be doing, you should be doing. It's free, it doesn't cost anything. One more example of SERPs on fire. I want to talk uh, some more about why this is such an awesome thing and why you should be doing it. You know, a long time, for a very long time, people talked about Google PageRank, PageRank, links, PageRank. Let me tell you something. Since about 2005, the game has been based on trust and authority and anything that you can do to improve your website's trust and authority is beneficial it's going to help you to rank better and when you have an image next to your listing doesn't that establish trust it certainly does it, it certainly can only help your uh, results now as we move forward I'm going to show you some additional ways we're not done yet I've got more great information and what's really exciting is if you want to learn more about this stuff, how to make it work, I'm going to give you some resources that you can get this done for free. And I'll also give you an opportunity to get a tremendous package that I've put together with Aiden Booth that'll walk you through how to do this. More on that later, but for now, I just want to continue kind of opening your eyes to all the things you could be doing to get better results, to drive more traffic, and ultimately to make more money. So let's talk about schema, okay? So schema came along not too long ago, and it's just one way that Google gives webmasters the ability to encode certain variables in their website. So when Google indexes them, those variables are displayed on the search engine results pages. Let me show you exactly what that means. So here's exactly what a listing looks like inside of Google when the website is leveraging and using a schema. Now schema is a simple uh, bit of code that is embedded into your page that gives Google additional information that they're easily able to display on the page. And in this case, they're displaying um, room and lodge rates uh, for a hotel listing right here. So pretty exciting stuff. And not only can you do that with the schema, but you can also embed things like star ratings. And if you look at this result right here, what I did is I searched for a product uh, in Google, which is Fat Loss for Idiots. Now, this is a, a digital product that's been selling on ClickBank very well for a long time. And the website owner here has done something pretty savvy and has installed a schema plugin that allows people to rate uh, the product. And here you can see this has got 107 votes. And again, what does that make you think? You know, this is a helping in establishing trust because you can see right here, 107 people have voted and on average, the product gets a three and a half star review for fat loss for idiots. Now, the other thing I want to draw to your attention is this particular person again is fairly savvy and they're doing the right kind of things uh, again the kind of things that uh, that I'm doing and that is uh, she's leveraging Google authorship and she's got her nice little image next to her listings and these are exactly the kind of things you want to be thinking about you want to be leveraging with your internet marketing 
It's important to understand what's happening now. It's important to stay current. And this stuff, guys, is about as current as you can possibly get. So I hope you've enjoyed this video. And if you want additional information on how you can level, level, how you can leverage schema, Google authorships, video site maps, video listings, basically how you can get your listings to stand out, head over to marketingeasystreet.com. Again, that's marketingeasystreet.com. And if you look at the second blog listings, you'll see something called SERPs on fire. And just head there, have a have a look at the article. It's a pretty in-depth article. We give you information on where to get some plugins for free, how to make this stuff happen, and you'll also find about a 60 or 70 minute webinar replay from my partner Aiden Booth on making these things happen. Now I also want to let you know that I am teaming up with Aiden and we've created a tremendous bonus for a product that I highly endorse. And the product comes from Mark Ling. Now, Mark is someone that's been in the industry for a long time. He's someone that I respect, and it's it's kind of fun. Whenever I uh, hear about Mark's story or, or read about Mark, oftentimes what comes up is some of his early successes. And Mark had success as an affiliate marketer selling posters. And I had the exact same success. Now, uh, Mark was targeting... Um, movie stars and celebrity posters and I was targeting artists paintings and prints I was selling for art.com and Mark was selling for, for all posters we both did really really well now again like I said I've teamed up with uh, Aiden Booth Aiden is someone that's been with me for about three or four years uh, he first uh, was introduced to me through Mark of all things and Mark had a webinar promoting one of my products and Aiden showed up he bought the product and he's been going great guns ever since and we've got a tremendous bonus on all the stuff that I've been talking about. And if you want to take advantage of this, if you want to get uh, to the finish line a little sooner, if you want to get results quicker, sooner than later, then our bonus is exactly going to help you do just that. And what I want to let you know, guys, is that this is a bonus that's based on what's happening right now in 2012. This is a bonus that's been compiled of information that I've put together personally myself. It's been put together and compiled by information that Aiden has recorded himself. This is us teaching. This is what we do best. And because of that, I think you're going to find the bonus to be tremendous. Now, first, we're going to give you access to our Penguin dossier. So we had the big pe uh, Penguin update. And Aiden and I uh, collaborated. We had a couple meetings, and then Aiden went ahead and, and formatted an amazing uh, PDF that you're going to get access to on exactly how to move forward after a uh, Google Penguin update. And we're also going to give you access to an in-depth uh, PDF guide on Google authorship, on how to establish Google authorship, how to get that little icon next to your listings. And if that's not enough, you're going to get some uh, videos. I think it's uh, three videos that Aiden, I don't think, I know, it's three videos that Aiden recorded to accompany this PDF. You're going to get access to that as well. Now, last summer I paid a developer $5,000 to create a video sitemap plugin to get those kind of video results that I showed you in this very video. And you can go ahead and I'm going to give you access to the plugin. It's called Video Easy Button and it's going to help you to incorporate a Google video sitemap right on your site. And you're going to get that today when you buy a Philo Blueprint for just $77. That's all it's going to cost. Now the price is going up on Wednesday. So I want you to be aware that right now you can get this uh, product uh, for $77. The price is increasing on Wednesday, so uh, you know make the decision uh, sooner than later. You're also going to get access to a 90-day boot camp. You're going to watch Aiden launch a site, establish traffic, and begin to make sales with the 90-day boot camp. You're also going to get access to 25 premium WordPress themes. We're also going to give you our Google Sniper report. This is going to help you to establish links on high-traffic videos located on YouTube to drive more traffic. And lastly, it's uh, not lastly, I actually ran out of space. There's so much stuff in the bonus, I ran out of space. But I'm going to give you Revenge of the Affiliate. And this is something I'm really excited about. This was a little product I put together in January. 
It's comprised of about a 15-page PDF, a two-hour webinar video that I went through and I highlighted my entire strategy for this very year, for 2012. And I laid out exactly what I was going to do, how I was going to move forward, and I was going to, I really laid out how I'm differentiating my business now from what I've done in the past and how I'm leveraging sites like Facebook, YouTube, uh, Amazon to, to drive sales. And what's really exciting is today I had my first book sale. I've actually had about 40 sales, but I just increased the price of my book to uh, $2.99. It doesn't sound like much, right? But what's really neat is that Amazon is paying me 70% uh, residual royalties for the sale of that uh, book, and um, I just increased the price to $2.99. So I get paid about $2 on every sale, and it's just really exciting to see it move forward. And I'll also let you know, this is the first time I've mentioned it, but I've been doing a lot of work with Facebook lately, And I got about 1,400 fans based on the strategy that I'm moving forward with now with Revenge of the Affiliate. And again, this is a, a neat product. I'm really proud of it. You're going to get all this amazing stuff when you buy a fellow blueprint through the affiliate link of Aiden Booth and Brian G. Johnson. So thanks a lot for watching. Go ahead and click this link uh, below this video and get access to this information, get access to our bonus. It's going to really help save you a ton of time. The last thing you don't want to do is spend a ridiculous amount of time trying to make this stuff work. We've got clear tutorial videos. Not only that, we've got plugins that make the process seamless. Uh, you're going to be able to drive more traffic and make more money in 2012. So go ahead and make the purchase. This is Brian G. Johnson, and thanks for watching.